Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. So if you are watching my video first time, please subscribe my channel. It will be helpful for you. And if you are the beginners for learning grammar or spoken English, for you I have uploaded number of videos before. So I share the link in the description box. Please click and watch it. And watch this video till end. If something is entertaining, but it's very very serious matter. Yes. So we the people feel that for day twenty four hours is not enough. Am I right? So about this we have discussed in the last video. So. Here I am not going to talk about time management but more than that it is very very important for each and everyone in this life. Have you ever thought either our profession or our personal life which one is important for us? If I ask this question to you, you may give the simple reply that there is no time to think about. Yes. So we are too busy. Why are you busy? What is the reason behind? For what purpose you are running for? You just think of that. See, you have a small family. Yes. If you are a man, you have wife and children. And to even your parents. If you are a woman, you have husband, children, and to your remaining family members. So hence, each and every house is like a small cage. Yes. So this cage should be filled with enough love. You know, the building has two meaning. One is called as home, and Another one is called as house. So what is the difference between this home and house? Do you know the meaning? See, home means where we get enough love. House means where we could stay for a day or for a week. So which one is home means which is our house? Where is my father and where is my mother and where are our children? So that is concerned as home. So you ask question yourself just now. Wholeheartedly you think about you. Who you are in your home. Okay. So as a mother have you showed enough love towards your family? As a father. Have you taken care about your family members? How many hours you spent with your family every day? Whether it's morning time or it's mean evening time or even weekend. Whether it's Saturday or it's Sunday. So whenever maybe for a week you can calculate how many hours you spent with your family members. And what about your children? Do they speak with you? Do you provide time to speak with you? Do they have time to share their problems with you? So you raise all the question yourself in your mind and get the answer yourself. So if you follow these all the things, you are a good family man and you are a good family girl. See, this busy life, we are running for money. For whom do you yearn first? For your family members. Am I right? As you earn more money, do your family members respect you? Do you feel so? Do they have enough love with you? See, I don't think to make any problems in your family. Okay? So for example, 
one father he goes abroad after he get married i mean within two months or three months he goes abroad and he comes back after five years so his wife got a baby yes he returns after five years that means the child now exactly four years yes so this is the first time you introduce your husband this is your daughter or this is your son and this is the first time you introduce to the child he is your father see what a fun it is when you have a child at that time as a father he is supposed with you because it's his son it's his daughter but after four years, you introduce the members. Yes, he is the father and she or he is your child. Which world we are? See, for whom you are working? So, at present in the first sight, the child fear about this person. Because he is the guy who has long beard and especially it is white beard. And white mustard. See, he's too old. So the child can't accept this immediately. Though they talk over phone or though they see this person already, the video calls. When they see that particular person directly, it's not easy to accept. How many days it will take? Do you know? Getting good bonding with this child and father. If I ask this question. Why do you run for money? Why do you concentrate only your job means? Your simple answer. Money makes everything. Yes. Money makes everything. I agree with you. But more than this. Love makes everything. It's everlast. You just think of your parents once. How many hours they spent with you? Each and everything happened only with the help of your parents. Each and every moment you spend with your parents. So for an example, when you went to school, if you return evening time, didn't you expect your parents supposed to be there? Did you ask? So that is love. Though they earn some, maybe it is 50 rupees or it is 100 rupees. Therefore, they bought a sweet. It's just for 25 pies. Isn't it love? Don't you love your parents? Do you show to their parents? You haven't given anything, costly things. So our life is zero. There's nothing is there. We hate our parents. Do you think so? Yet you love your parents, no? Though the parents didn't have money, they should end up love with you. They provide the things how much they could. Now you spend something, 5,000 means they spend 50 rupees. But there also we had love. We love our parents. Our parents loved us very much. When we have a problem, our parents with us, they console us. Now the condition, what's happening? Any morning they go to school, evening you are sending them to tuition. Early morning again they wake up 4 o'clock, 5 o'clock they go to school. Working person, early morning they go for work. See, just a few days, I think before two weeks, I had a chance to travel one place. So exactly I could see that it's Tirupur district. <clears throat> we started our journey with family previous day night. So early morning 4.30 we reached there. Really I was totally shocked. Exactly 4.30 we reached there. At that time we could find all the buses, it's enough crowd. 
not only men even the women so each and every one is workers they are working in different places so men means it doesn't matter you just think of the women she goes for cruelly every day what is the condition of that family what about their children how they spend time with that children how they get love or affection from that parents this is the main reason nowadays the people they are committing a lot of mistakes i mean the children they are taking wrong decisions they commit suicide even because there is no one is ready to share their problems there is no time to share the problems there is no time to give solution for their problems mother is working father is working early morning you are leaving late night you reach home so in between what bond do you have really i felt so sorry about why you are you being like this i asked the simple question for whom you are earning money if i ask you replace i have a daughter i have a son so for their studies i need money so my daughter she is supposed to get married so there's a dowry system for that purpose we need money and for the son we need a job for the son we need one house yes so for these all the things we are working for yes you have to it's your duty but no need to give one bundle money no need to give one bundle of gold what do you work what do you have by that you can choose the person that son why do you give bundles using that bundle what are they going to do you know 100 pounds you give me is today you give it tomorrow they just keep it in the locker what's the use you are running 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 back up money yes without food without leisure time without love you work hard you earn money and you give to someone they collect everything and they keep it in the locker safe who is going to use that money and who is going to use that gold just think of that and again some of the people they probably say that i earn money it's not only for my son even five generation can stay at home and eat so that much i have earned for what purpose it is see you have only one life you have to live for you not for someone next generation who will come who knows after two generation whether the people will be there or not who knows you are working 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 your whole life you have spent only for earning money so hence you just turn your life if you see there there is nothing even single minute you have been spent for you so your life is wasted instead this no need to come to this world so try to work for only you no need to save anything for your children okay as a parents your duty is just guide them which way they can go just guide don't think to walk that same path instead of your child so i hope you understand what i come to say yes our duty is only guiding the child not walking the same way where my son or daughter has to move okay so you chance for them let them work hard okay you show the way they can learn 
they can work they can learn they know how to handle their life yes live for you you struggled a lot when you were child yes you struggled a lot when you were adulthood so that's say what did you lost there nothing to us you got a good lesson by the experience when you have poverty you learn the lesson what's the value of food when you suffer for money you learn the lesson what is the value of money when you suffer for job you value that you got the lesson yes how what job is very very important for our life so everything we got it from our experience so the same experience don't the children want to get it don't you feel that always don't try to pamper your child let them fail and get sick then only they come to know if they fail what will happen so they need some kind of experience you chance for that if you learn for next generation then that generation people what will they do in their life do you feel let them stay in the bed and sleep well don't they need to work so they can do see we feel that we suffer a lot by money by shelter by food so our generations should not suffer but the reality is if you earn enough money for next generation surely that generation will spoil its own life as they have enough money automatically they will have head weight so they will not respect anyone they will not work hard they will not show kindness there is no love yes so hence they will spoil their life and even the surrounding also see you know about my grandfather you know about my father yes you can't against me yes i have a big background i have money so i can do anything as i have enough money so the total character will be changed you just see someone's life what's happening nowadays the person yearn for generations that people what do they do now my guess i don't think to shout to you but i think to make you to analyze the reality our life it is only one time we should live for our life i mean our family show enough love spend more time with your family members be a good father be a good husband be a good mother and even the children too i request to the children also be a good children for your parents whatever may be please share whatever problem you have please sit and share it and try to give solution for them don't say i don't have time let me see tomorrow let me see after one week so don't think to postpone when one filled with enough deep pressure don't try to give more stress for your family members try to reduce them try to console them always your duty is pampering your family not with money but with love you know one thing the person who is good at his profession he is not apt for his personal life the person who is good at in his or her personal life they will not be good at their profession okay 
so any one of the area they are working with and other area it is blank so don't be so you should know to balance these both profession is important for us because we need money at the same time our personal life is very very important for us because money may come today and it may go tomorrow again day after tomorrow if we need we can earn it but love love if you last once you cannot get it back whether it's your wife or else it's your children you just sit and talk with your family members yes am i a right person am i a good husband for you am i a good father for you you just talk with them they will speak from their heart their feelings so at that time only you come to know how many mistakes you have committed unknowingly you feel that i provide everything i have enough money so i provide everything whatever my son asks i buy for them whatever my wife asks i buy everything for them so they are so happy they have big house yes they have car they have bike so whenever wherever they think to go they can go and they can enjoy their life this is not the happiest life so the happiest life is when a family sit together and have a talk when a family sit together and have a dinner so that is the happiest moment we can understand each other we can understand each and everyone's feelings they can share the feelings we can give the solution so that is the happiest moment so both is important for us but try to balance it over time work you can avoid this early morning 4:30 or 5 o'clock is too bad 8 9 o'clock it's okay evening before 6 o'clock if you are a mother especially you are supposed be there before 6 o'clock before your children reach yes so both we need morning train and night train you are supposed to spend the time with your family members and day train you can work that's your profession so if you maintain so there is no problem at all there is no mistake will be erased no one commit mistake we cannot find criminals we cannot find thieves yes we cannot find any terrorist we cannot find the person who has taken decision without their parents decision their own decision they have taken these all the things only happen because of the parents i can say so spend time with your parents spend time with your children both is important for us okay so both if you maintain so surely your life will be happiest life so love is the everlast one please keep it with you it is for your personal and also for your profession okay so profession also we have to love then only we can work well and we can earn more so love this both personal and profession very very important for us yes so this is the thing i have to share to you so i hope you also enjoy this if you like this please try to follow this and again we can meet in next video till then take care of your health thank you